हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वंस अगेन वेलकम टू भोलानाथ एकेडमी इन दिस वीडियो स्टूडेंट्स वी आर गोइंग टू सी द क्वेश्चन थर्टीन एंड क्वेश्चन थर्टीन स्टूडेंट्स वी हैव एंथालपी चेंज द क्वेश्चन इज गिवन द एंथालपी चेंज चेंज इन एंथालपी ऑफ द फॉलोइंग रिएक्शन दिस इज मिथिन गैस रिएक्ट विद क्लोरिन गैस इट इज गिवज यू मिथाइल क्लोराइड गैस एंड एसियल गैस दिस रिएक्शन इज स्टूडेंट्स या द एंथालपी चेंज दैट इज डेल्टा या जीरो ऑफ रिएक्शन इज गिवन माइनस वन किलो जोल इट इज गिवन निगेटिव अंडरस्टैंडिंग स्टूडेंट्स You have to calculate, students. Please pay attention. You have to calculate carbon chloride bond enthalpy. The bond enthalpy between carbon and chloride. What will be the bond enthalpy of this carbon chloride bond enthalpy? If the bond enthalpies of others are given, yes, students. Carbon hydrogen it is given 444 kilojoule per mole. Carbon carbon bond enthalpy is given 243, and hydrogen chloride bond enthalpy is given 431. Okay, students. So, students, what will be the bond enthalpy between carbon and chloride? Understand, students. So what happens, students? We have to just see the reaction, students. Here, methane gas. How you write, students? Methane. So this carbon, how many hydrogen? Four hydrogen. So this way you can see at the reactant side. In methane, you have four carbon hydrogen bond. It is reacting with chlorine gas. In chlorine molecule, you have chlorine chlorine bond. Understand, students? This is the gas. This is also gas, students. Methane gas react with chlorine gas. It will gives you. It will gives you CS three. CS three and Cl. So here you will find three carbon hydrogen bond and one carbon chloride bond. Understanding students, the examination is asking this carbon chloride bond. What will be the bond enthalpy of this? Okay students, if I and hydrogen chloride you can write like this. Understanding students, here this is the reactant students and this is what product. So how you will since students here already bond enthalpy of reaction is given. Since you know the formula students, since you know delta here is zero. Of reaction, it is is nothing but sum of enthalpies, bond enthalpies of reactant. That is standard sum of all the bond enthalpy of reactant minus sum of all the standard bond enthalpies of product. Understanding students? So when you see students, how many bond enthalpies are there in reactant? So you will find there is a four carbon hydrogen bond enthalpy and one chloride chloride bond enthalpy. So what happens students? You have to put this. Bracket like this, in square bracket, students, you will write all the bond enthalpy. How many bonds are present? Carbon hydrogen, four carbon hydrogen bond enthalpy. So you have to write four times delta S yes, zero of carbon hydrogen. Okay, students. Now, how many one one molecules of delta S yes, zero of chlorine 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 bond enthalpy? Okay, students. You have to subtract bond enthalpies of reactant. How many students you have? Three bond enthalpy of carbon hydrogen plus students you have one bond enthalpy of carbon chloride and one bond enthalpy standard bond enthalpy of carbon hydrogen, carbon hydrogen and chloride. Okay, students. So this is the way you have to write. What happens when this minus will go inside? At the time, students, all will becomes negative. This will becomes negative. So you can write, students. If you open the bracket, students, this is nothing but four delta s zero of carbon hydrogen plus one delta s zero chlorine chlorine bond. Now this minus will go inside, students. It becomes three delta s zero of carbon hydrogen. Minus one delta S zero of carbon chloride. Minus one delta S zero of hydrogen chloride bond. Okay, students. Now see the students similarities. Here you have four, and here you have what three? Now students four minus three, you will get one. One delta S zero of carbon hydrogen. Now if we here students carbon chloride only one is there, so write one delta S zero of carbon chloride chloride bond. This is chloride chloride bond. Now students. This is carbon chloride bond minus one delta S zero of carbon chloride bond enthalpy, and you have one delta S zero of hydrogen chloride bond enthalpy. Just put the value, students. Put the value. It is already is given. This is one hundred and four kilojoule. Kilojoule. I am not adding, students. I am just writing the. So one into four four hundred and fourteen plus one into chloride chloride bond is it is given, students. It is given chloride chloride bond is two forty three. Kilojoule, 
minus 1 into it is not given students so write as it is that is you have to find this standard enthalpy of carbon chloride bond which is not given right as it is and it bond enthalpy of carbon hydro hydrogen and chloride is, is it is given 431 understanding students when you multiply students you will get 104 multiply 4 and 4 4 and 4 1 ja, 414 plus 243 1 ja, 243 and this will becomes what minus 431 minus 1 delta multiply will be like this one students carbon chloride bond understand you students so you have to add these two and subtract students what happens students you will find 104 which is equals to 7 5 and 6 minus 431 minus delta s 0 and carbon chloride bond understand you students when you subtract students you will find this is nothing but 6 7 minus 1 6 5 minus 3 2 and 4 minus 6 minus 4 will be 2 minus delta s 0 of carbon chloride this is 104 students 1 what happens when this all quantity will come on this side so you'll find delta s 0 carbon chloride is nothing but 104 minus 2 to 6 see students please pay attention it is already given in negative quantity so this negative negative when you add students it will becomes positive that is becoming 330 kilojoule per mole okay students so this way students you have got the standard enthalpy of carbon chloride bond which is given 330 minus 3 minus minus will add so this way you students you have got the value if you like my video please share it subscribe it thank you thank you very much have a nice day god bless you